Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Troy back again with another video. Sorry I've not been uploading at all. <laughs> school, man. School got me busy right now, but I'll be uploading regular, I guess, soon. But I'll let y'all know. But for today, we're going to talk about this amazing software that I found out about lately. And I'm starting to use it now for drawing and stuff. And yeah so let's get into it so this software is called Terra um, Design Doll and it's by this company called Terra Terra Well I believe it's it basically like references drawings for you I guess if you want to like draw a character or something for some comics or animatics and you want a certain pose that you can't find a reference for on online well you can use this for that pose that pose so you, you just like move your character around the 3d model and get the pose you want you know and you can also add like weapons in here as long as it's like not say another object you can add it in here so if it if it can be attached to the character you can add it in here so like a sword I have a sword so I could like click on the arm that the hand that I wanna put the sword in go here um, right click that add tag and add in an import tag click that import tag click the hand you want it to go to it goes to the right hand for default so we, I want it to be in the left so I click the left then put apply the scale so a sword is probably I don't know how many centimeters long probably brown uh, I don't even know nine not 90 like probably like 90 some um, centimeters maybe I'm gonna put 50 for now or 60 import mesh and the, the like the file the files you could import in here or they're like obj files so if, if you're similar with um, a 3d render software like blender or maya you could you you'll understand what this is and basically it's like moving like navigating around the software is the same as say using blender or um, Maya so you should be good with that if you already know how to like uh, like navigate in those other softwares so here's the sword we put it in now you, you like, just put it to where you want it to be in the shot you're making and you'll be good yeah it's cool real quick And if you want to like select the object you imported in all you have to do is go back to the, the tag thing right here that you applied and rotate it and move it around as you please so I want it to be in her hand like that alright let's get that here boom yo this is sick man I don't, I don't know why like I've never like heard about this or anything because I've been having problems with drawing my drawing poses certain poses and now that I found this like I'm gonna use it all the time and it's free for what you need it to do like pose a character there's like other stuff you could if you want to buy the software there's other stuff that you can't do with the free one so if you want to buy the software to do the other stuff I, I recommend that so but if you would just want to pose a character you don't have to like buy the software just get the free version so they have a website where you could basically download poses and apply them in here if you go to tool no help click the doll 
whatever this word is atelier um, I already have it open in Google but I'll just go here <coughs> disregard all that stuff it's for school homework <laughs> um, you could click the go find the pose you want say I want a fight pose since she have she, since she has a sword we go to fight and athletics sports all right boom find me a sword pose like that one oh come on oh, where is it at hold on just a second guys Well, all right, there we go. Nope. Where, where, where? Screw it. We just go with this one right here. All right. So, in the software, you just copy this code, right? The DA number. Copy that. Control C to copy and go back to the software and in here you would paste that number or just click the space and it'll paste it for you and when you hit enter it'll apply the pose you chose from the list it'll apply it here but since we have the free version it won't do it so if you want to like use the poses if you want to be lazy and use the poses they have you're free to do that just buy the software but if you're like me who like to like experiment and stuff and do shit on my own <laughs> just go in here and just have fun man just do what you love do what you love and animate or pose characters if that's what you love to do and there's also a morphing um, function in here uh, let me find it real quick I think this is it right here you could basically morph the character to look more like a dude so let me see all right here here we are so legs I want the character to have more of kind of like a guy leg so boom you turn that up it's so easy man it's so easy and this isn't like a paid promotion or anything the software is freaking cool arms we choose this one boom throw some muscles on there and um the torso we will choose this one it's more masculine hey starting to look look like goku bro oh shit all right um <clears throat> put some chest up in there so let's see um God. That's yeah. See, he's starting to look like a guy now. Yeah, a little bit. I don't like the the foot though. The foot's like really weird. So let's go change that and add this one for uh, not better. But let's see if there's a different one. Maybe I could add this one. Um, yeah, I think that's better. Yeah, that's way better. Now for the arms again. The arms are kind of like tiny. Let's see what this does. Oh, yes. Let's add it. Or. Yeah, well you get the gist guys, um, you could pose the character any how you want it, like, this software is just something else man, like, 
they deserve more recognition you know i was literally about to buy one of those dolls you could pose for drawing until i came up on this recently and i recently um saw it in a guy's video he was taught he wasn't he didn't go into detail he just said it's a software that he uses and he was basically naming a bunch of software he uses and he said design doll and I wanted to see what it was about so I checked it out and I'll put his channel somewhere on the screen or something but yeah it's a he, he's like really cool so you could check him out um, yeah but that's it for today um, hope you guys are having a good day uh, Cheers. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Peace out.